Okay, number 10 says a group of students uh, measures the distance a toy car has traveled after different amounts of time. A table of the data is shown. The students want to perform an analysis of the data set and consider removing the outlier point. All right, select all of the quantities that will change if the outlier point is removed from the data set. So here's the thing. Can you see right now the outlier point? It looks pretty clear in the distance column. The values are all basically ones, twos, threes, and fours other than this one right here. Okay, this value here is an outlier because this is far higher than any other values in the entire table. And so if we want to consider what changes if we remove that point, the first thing we need to determine is what are these values before that point is removed. So let's review the mean, the median, and the range. All right. From middle school, the mean is the average. Okay, you find the average by adding all the values. Okay, and you take that total and you divide it by the number of values that you had added together. And that finds you the mean or the average. The uh, median is the middle value. Or if it's an even number of terms, it is the average of the two middle values. So there's a little review of those vocabulary terms. And the last one is the range, is the span from the smallest to the largest value in the data set. All right, so let's consider this here. Um, let's find the mean of the time right now. The mean of the time you can find by adding 5 plus 6 plus 7 plus 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15. And we want to divide that by how many, how many time values do we have there? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Divide that by 11. So if I add all those up and divide by 11, let me do this real quick. What I end up with is 110 divided by 11. And that is 10. All right, that is the average of all the time values when I have that outlier point in there. All right, the outlier point is included here. Now, if you consider what would happen if we removed that 10 from the data value or from the data, then what we would end up with is we would add all these values up. And instead of dividing by 11 terms, we would have a sum of 100 and we'd only be dividing by 10. And so it turns out that the mean of the time, the time average, um, would not change. And they want to know the quantities that will change. Okay, this one won't change if we remove the outlier. Okay, and that's just a coincidence there that that happened. The reason nothing changed is because the outlier value was the, the mean of the, of the original data set. So that's kind of a fluke there. Normally, when you remove a value, the mean does change, as it will with the distances. Um, if we find the mean with the 11.0 value included, and then we remove that 11.0 value, the average is definitely going to change. So um, let's do add all values in the distance column and then divide by 11 values. And then if we add all the values but without the 11.0 in it, we could find that average 
So I'm going to go ahead and do this. You can do the same if you've got a handheld calculator. Add all those values up. 1.0 plus 1.2 plus 2.4 plus 3.3 plus 3.7 plus 11.0 plus 4.2 plus 3.7 plus 4.8 plus 4.5 plus 4.9. 3, 4, 5. It's 11 values. Okay, it comes to 44.7. divided by 11. And that is 4.06 approximately. But if I add all those up without the 11 involved, then what I end up with is 33.7 divided by 10, and that gives me 3.37. And so did that value change when we remove the um, outlier value? Definitely the value of the mean is going to change. All right, the median of the time and the median of the distance. Um, let's first consider the median of the time. Because there are 11 values in this chart, the median is that outlier point. That outlier point is the median. So the median originally was a 10, but if we removed that, the median would be the average of the middle two values would still be a 10. All right, so if we remove the outlier point, the median value um, would be staying the same. So. Median won't change. Okay, if we remove that outlier value, the median won't change. To find the median of the distance, you, the only choice you have is to list these in order, um, which they are not at this point. So let me make a list of these in order. 1.0. We've used it. 1.2. 2.4, and then 3.3, 3.7, and then 4.2, 4.5, 4.8, 4.9, 4.10, value is 11. So with the 11 involved, the middle value, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, is the sixth value. So this is the median with that value in place. But if I was to remove the 11, okay, if I was to remove the 11 from that data set, then the cut line would be between the two middle terms. It would be between 3.7 and 3.7. So sure enough, if I remove the outlier, it just so happens because of the repeating 3.7s in the middle of the table, or in the middle of the data, that the median would actually not be affected. Okay, the median of the distance won't change. Okay, it stays 3.7. And what did the other one, it, this one, the median of the time stays 10. So, nothing there. All right, the last thing to check is the range, and this is pretty easy. Um, the range of the time wouldn't change. Okay, the range would stay going from 5 to 15. So this won't change. If we remove that middle value where of 10 seconds, um, the range stays going from 5 seconds to 15 seconds. But the range of the distance will change because originally 
the range would have been for the distances, the range started with the smallest value of 1.0 and the largest value 11.0. And the, um, if you remove the outlier, then the range will start at, at 1.0, but then next highest value is 4.9. So it will go from 1.0 to 4.9, which is a much smaller range. So a um, lot of analysis, and I'll just tell you, having looked at the scoring guide, if you have anything other than that second box and the last box marked, um, you won't get any, any point for this one point question. So it's important that you don't jump to conclusions. You take your time and evaluate each of those values, the mean, the median, and the mode of the data before the outlier is removed and then after the outlier is removed.